Twinkle E, Twinkle D. We got ourselves another stream of Solaris. Yes, we D. Oh boy. Rivalry. Oh, okay. Nope. It. Oh no. The pact. The pact is. Oh no. It wasn't even the pact. It was our allies who just declared them as rivals. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So it looks like our esteemed allies have decided to go ahead and support us. And the alliance between mushrooms and humanoids are continue to grow. And last time we were here, we are still in second place. We are still crushing it. Ah, <sighs> we're doing a good job. Yeah, still got those pirates in the centralized space there. Uh, wow, that is not so good. <laughs> wow, okay, we haven't been playing for a full 10 minutes and already there's been a rivalry declare, declare between the north and the, like, the east of the galaxy. And now a commercial pact between the south and the east. And they just became a federation. Oh. So it looks like the pact here is gonna try their best to go ahead and, you know, declare war on all of this. That's not good. That's really not good. Especially when they've allied themselves with the largest empire in the galaxy right now. Yeah, we got some improving relations with these guys. In fact, so, uh, rip you. Okay, let's watch it. Let's watch it go. Poof, there it went. <laughs> oh. What the hell is this? Having decrypted the signal, Merog Torres was astonished to discover it was broadcasting to an archaic form of the main Gordanian app, the main Gordanian languages, speaking in these and those and whence force. It appears to be reciting one of the lost works of Jung Torres, a renowned Gordanian playwright who lived some 600 years ago. Hey, hey, don't create my own lore, thank you very much, leave that to me. Oh. Oh yes, that's what we need resources. Let's attempt to go ahead and give ourselves a better reputation with the apes here. Oh, they really don't like us. So yeah, improve those words. Survey this last fucking star. I want to know what's out here at the exact edge of the fucking universe. Well, it's not, but it's close. It's close. I cannot wait to just get a just get a fully operational star base in there. <laughs> just like. It's no purpose, but like, screw it. Typhoon's generated district's almost ha, nice. Maybe if we do roll the fear campaign. I feel like if we do that, though, it's gonna harm our relation to the greater galaxy. And like, you know, hey, while we are evil, you know, I don't want us to get fucked this early. Despite the fact that, you know, we've been going for 91 years now and 10 collective streams for about 20 hours total. So everyone's happy. They're all living a happily ever after. The end. And then just the screen blows up and the stream's over. <laughs> so let's let's try honestly. So I wanna see, could I theoretically just punch in right here? I really wanna chance that, but you know I don't think I will. Oh, what the hell, who gives a shit? Oh, fuck. So, yeah, we may just be relegated to staying up to the north. The final rest? What? By what has been beyond the astronomical odds, the J.R. Tolga Utah actually managed to pinpoint the source of the odd signals as his sword passed through the asteroid belt, a tiny alien construct. A simple scan reveals at some point it was a rich container. Open the coffin and study the corpse. We will know what has made them tick and talk. Wait, what? We are in breach of this? Excuse me? How are we in breach of this constant of this? Yo, detail this. That's all we get, okay. So, so wait, so wait, how are we in breach of this? We don't have, we don't purge, we're just militaristic. Calm your titties. 
No one likes a good old game of sci-fi war, I swear to god. Sure. Salty. Okay. Our top priority is going to be uh, anywhere else. Oh no. They got in here. Oh no. I don't watch the monitor. Oh no. I apologize. Yes. Oh. Oh no, no, not more pirates. Okay, yes, yes, continue. Okay, where are you at? Okay, so we got that there. We got 240 here. Yeah, you guys, you guys just run around right now. Yeah, I want to know where the Cassius Bale is. It's is target of the Cassius Bella. Oh. Oh my. So the good old shrooms to the north and our apes to the south aren't really fans of one another, apparently. Ooh, that's intrigued. That's space drama right there. I'm intrigued. I'm invested in that. Oh, oh, there they go. And here they are. So immediately... Uh, let's see here. Wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. There we go. Attack target. So they have six ships compared to our 12. <sighs> Guys, really, now's not the time. So let's just see, let's just see this. And then... Another war of piracy has begun. Go, my troopers, go. So they already lost one of their ships, which is great. They okay, lost two of their ships. We have yet to lose a single one. Oh, and our population went up by two. Sweet. Uh, we'll check that out for the battle. Come on, boys. Come on, we're boxing them in like it's nothing. Down to two ships. Down to one ship. We won. Bam. And we got a time project. So, immediately, before we do anything, I want us to get your butt over here. Wait a second, what? Okay, here. Yeah, okay. So you're already moving there, which is good. Oh, hi, yes. Wait, no. Change that up. Uh, I want us to move here instead. Because we got... We got a good chunk of time, though. But still, though, I want to see... Oh. Well, then let's check it out. Let's see what this is like. Let's see what this does. Yeah, we only lost 2% off of that. 2% of our health off of that. So I wonder what this is. It hasn't engaged anything. We'll be there for a couple seconds. Oh, oh, oh. It's a station. Okay. Okay. It's a station. Okay. Uh, why can I attack this? What is this menu? What? Oh, here. Uh, I don't know why I can't get like a... Unless it's just automatically gonna open fire. Thank you again for saving. Oh yeah, it just automatically opens fire for us.
Okay, so really going in hard against. Uh, this is concerning. Oh, we got it. Let's go, baby. We're the best. Tweedledee, Tweedledee. We got six months left for those fusion reactors, can't you see? We got two months left, and we get cruisers! And our military power expands evermore! Ah, 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 days. Making it to ten streams. I mean, hey, we made it to ten streams, yeah. We did. Merry Christmas. You passed that? Lads, we have completed our first century in Solaris. And conveniently enough, on the day of the new year, we're still suffering from a housing crisis. <laughs> oh boy. We're suffering a lot. <laughs> uh, it's no big deal. What? Woo! Neil and Touch. The X. Wait, wh where's the enemy X? Okay, go to that. Uh, wait, pause. Pause here, pause here, pause here. Okay, how close are you guys to anything? Fuck, you guys are not close to anything. Oh. Yeah, I think it isn't gonna survive much longer. Oh, yeah, that thing's gonna die soon. guys are we got we got some edict stuff all right uh we're just gonna max out supremacy then and let's go ahead and get us get us some more so let's see your stop race influence cost that's actually really good uh grasp the void star race capacity goes away five we don't really need to worry about that right now i think we're gonna go ahead and roll with interstellar Do Dumb, yeah, to me. So I just realized that we're, uh, I just realized something though. We're gonna lose all our armor. We haven't even begun to lose all our hull points. And we've taken down two of their ships successfully now. We actually went ahead and like got, uh, forces. Hey, I wanna, how's the second defense platform? Yeah, second defense platform is gonna be over with no problem at all. Oh, population walls went up by one. A fleet up in half, and just send one to the frontier, and just keep one near the core sectors. Because that, sh that that fleet size is 21 ships. I think that fleet can be broken up. So yeah, uh, we... Oh. Yeah, no. We, we took it out before it even had a chance. Wow. Okay, awesome. Here. So, yeah. So, I actually want us to go ahead and you come to Niji. I was really tempted to call that Nijima. And just be like, hey, hey, name Sai. The ban or gang of slave trade is still in debate, and I love that. Uh, now to reap the stars. All right, cool. Just making sure. I ain't even talking about me singing. I've been singing this entire playthrough. First and foremost, I do not appreciate you threatening me with a Karen. That is very offensive. Second of all, wow, that is an actual threat. I need my Empire Sprawl to go down a little too. I mean, but down, I mean like actually give me a chance to go ahead and like make sure I don't get killed so we'll see where we go with that I'm personally against it because I want to go ahead and up the research game from our people 
because we're, we're going to use some good old Thrawn tactics here. We know more about that. We know about their, them and their culture. We're definitely going to win the war. Election? Oh, god damn it. Okay, our High Razor died. Shit. Guys. Space Captain Jack Sparrow can be our president. That's who we're going with. We're going with Captain Jack Sp Space Captain Jack Sparrow. Yeah, everyone just joined us. No, no one wants to cease like not sharing scientific secrets. I love that. What I'm really excited about is terraforming. That's what I'm more excited for terraforming. Then those are like every planet we currently control that's in a red zone can be a green zone. And that's more population, that's more workers, that's more people, that's more monies. And that's more power. Jeez. I hate my phone sometimes. My my big, ginormous hands kill me. Whatever. Oh, is that How the hell did you get in here? Oh right, you have an open door policy with them. Right. How are we doing our factions? Yeah, no 69 joke coming in for the stream highlights, but bam. Yeah, and these guys really, really don't like us at all. <laughs> but still, though, I mean, they are equivalent on a lot of stuff to us, which is good. Ooh, what's this? Uh, yeah, we'll get to that soon. Migration? Oh my god! <sighs> Wow, I'm the only person opposing this. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, wait, no. Yeah, they just conquered. Oh, and we're losing a lot of consumer goods now. Oh, fuck. <laughs> uh, Transcorn is extremely lethal predator. Neelink. That stalks the dense jungles of Ijax 2 at night. Par Realizing its paralytical shocks before sucking their brains out with a tube-like mouth. That's fucking king. So that's gonna take a collective 3,500 days. <laughs> uh, oh, wait, what? What? Oh. Ooh, we're looking to treat. Karish Obaya has developed new skills. Yay! New skills, new skills, new skills. Chant it with me in the chat. This is a way to go ahead and fortify our borders and go ahead and get our trade value up. We gotta get the monies. The monies. Ooh. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Now we're losing food. Ah, uh, yes. The end of the first hour curse that is still art. Okay. How we? They still are here. They are still all here. <sighs> they are still all here. Every single one of them is all here. Okay, so from what I've got, this is five cruisers alone. This is three cruisers. Oh dear God. Okay. Do we do this? We're doing this. Okay, first things first. We are going to aim for the closest and weakest of the fleets, which will be right here. Also, someone died. So, all of them are still present. Every single one of them is still present. Oh god, it's actually just chugging like a racehorse right now. It's just so many things are on screen. We're going in, boys. Yeah, thanks, thanks, thanks for saving literally right here, right now. So, alright, this could end up being one of the worst decisions we've ever made in this game. We could be taking out some of our most powerful ships right here, right now. Yeah, uh, you don't say, game. Oh, resolution was passed. It wasn't even that we were engaging hostiles. Oh wait, the only the pirate ships. Those are the squid ships. I mean, how, are we used to fighting squid ships? I don't know. Oh, 
Oh, we just lost a ship. Oh, we just lost two whole ships. It lags so much that, oh my god. It's just lagging so much. Yep. Yep. Fs. Constant Fs. So, we now know that all 20,000 are still prevalent. They are still here. I love how we, how I went this stupid route and went on ahead and just like, hey, let's take this from the very edge of our empire and bring it all the way back to the capital instead of just doing the easy thing and just building a capital ship right now. Building a fresh shipper. Oh, hell no. We're rolling with that. Yeah, we're taking the 33 months. We're rolling with that. Holy shit, yes. Yo, we can get artificial fleet in? Fuck yes. Okay, here we go. We got like four days left until they make the jump. Let's see them make the jump, guys. Let's see them make the jump. Yahoo! A fucking child. <laughs> uh, so yeah, we got we got like a couple more days left. There she is. There's our leading lady, guys. There she is. Best character in our entire game of Stellaris. <laughs> Space Jack Sparrow, who is in fact a woman. Leader level up. Ah yes, Voodweek. <laughs> Voodweek. I hate myself. Uh, where's our? There we go. Our construction ship made it back home. Oh my god! It only took us like all stream. <laughs> Ah, damn it, they all- oh, what, what? Dip. Okay. 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 It won't be next stream, but it will be soon. Run. Run, you birds. You may fly through the stars, but you can never escape the wrath of the Cortinian Empire. We will hunt you down. And we will find you. And when we do, he will regret everything you have just communicated to us in your very short existence it is. Three, two, one, a zero, BAM! Terraform. But, nonetheless, this is a value that neither myself nor any of you will ever be able to witness for some time in the future. Lads, I'm ending the stream here. And this is going to be the final Star stream for some time. Not some money. So we're going to play some more games I'm familiar with. Uh, definitely, like, Friday, we're going to immediately start off with Dark Stars 2, which is arguably my favorite game of all time. I love that game to death. We're going to put a hold on Star for some time. I really want to go ahead and get through that game first, and then probably do another couple streams of this, and then do something else. Regardless, though, if you guys found me through Stellaris, I thank you profusely. If you guys came in from 
uh, where I posted the links. And thank you guys so much. It truly does mean a lot to me. I hope you guys love this series as much as I love it. And I look forward to when I come back to this. Because I think it's going to be a lot of fun. And I can't wait for that. So, with that said, our stream day 12 of Stellaris comes to an end. Thank you guys so much for watching. Stay safe. Have a lovely night. Take care.